everyone. This will be the video for the Sailor Moon Crystal Act 16 review. And even though I watched it at 5 in the morning, <laughs> I don't really have time to watch it now. Uh, but I will do a semi-quick review, or at least try to, so we can get that up. Anyway, so Act 16, which aired yesterday, the 21st of February, was entitled Abduction Sailor Mercury. So, yeah, it picks up right where the last episode ended, where Sailor Moon is still in shock and upset that Sailor Mars got abducted. And uh, the second Ayakashi sister, I believe is how you say the name, uh, Birdie, I don't know if that's the Japanese, I think that's the English name, I don't know how to pronounce the Japanese, so I'll just call her Birdie. Uh, she took over, and uh, and she decides to do a chess um, plan. She pl decides to use chess in her plan, which that is a comparison to the 90s when Birdie did the chess game with Sailor Mercury. It um, At that time in the 90s, though, Katsy was cleansed from the Black Moon Negamoon, um, dark magic, whatever. Uh, but in this one, Katzy died in the last episode and Birdie takes over. She uses chess and she wants to fight Sailor Mercury. Ami, I think Ami Mizuno is the, la is the last name for Ami, but I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, she, she wants to, um, fight her for chess because she hears that she's a really good chess player. And, uh, oh yes, we do get a little glimpse of Ami's past. So we get to see her as a kid and we know, we learn that her father was an artist or is an artist. And of course we knew her mom was a doctor. So we kind of get to see a little more about for Ami and stuff. And, um, so yeah, anyway, speeding up a bit, cause again, I don't have much time. Uh, <laughs> uh that was something new that not and Crystal, because we didn't get to know in the past for, for, for the 90s. So that's something new. In the 90s also, um, when she did the chess chess match with Ami, it was kind of like in a chess building or whatever. I believe that's where it was. And Crystal, again, I watched this at 5 in the morning, so I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so she, she played chess with Ami, and uh Usagi was screaming at you know win Ami win or something like that or you can beat her and she kept getting warned and uh Monaco Monaco wait is it Monaco yeah Monaco kept telling her to calm down and the people were telling her if she says it one more time she has to leave whereas in the 90s she didn't really scream out you know Ami's name and everything and so Ami, I believe, wins the tournament or wins the chess game and everything. And so the uh I believe she runs after Birdie for some reason. I can't remember. Uh but uh yeah, Birdie had a little pendulum thing or a little diamond thing she had, and she was using that to dictate her moves because she was kind of reading Ami's mind. That's new. She didn't have that in the 90s. And, uh, see, what else do I want to say? Hmm. Okay, well, real quickly, um, so they get outside of the building, and somehow Chibiusa appears, and she wasn't even in the, um, building during the chess match. And we find out that the people inside the building were the minions that Birdie used for her plan. So they were, a, it was a trap. So, uh, I believe Ami used the Shine Aqua Illusion, I think. Or, anyway, she uses one of her water attacks. Um, and Birdie kind of blocks it and causes her to get trapped. And then Sailor Moon shows up and uses the Kitty Moonrod to re... Or to, you know, get rid of Birdie. But again, it doesn't... Uh, it doesn't um, free Mercury. So Rubia shows up and takes Mercury 
to the dark crystal, at least that's what I'm calling it, the dark ship crystal or whatever, ship crystal. But uh, also something that they showed, this is going off the crystal version now, um, they showed Mer or Mars kind of, I believe, unconscious or something, kind of hanging in the air, saying, you know, she is no good, we, she doesn't know where Rabbit is, because that's what they call Chibi Yusa, they call her Rabbit. So, uh, yeah, they, they um, do that. So that's kind of like the gist of the episode. But real quickly, also that I want to say is uh, Mamoru finds, I believe, finds Chibiusa and takes her to his house. And he has the, the tuxedo mask puppet. And he, I'm, I believe, if I can remember correctly, when, uh, when Chibiusa stayed over in the 90s, uh, this was a quote from the 90s, I believe. He was telling her if she cries, the rose would wilt. And he said that also in the in crystal, which I thought was kind of a really nice thing um, to kind of keep a quote from the 90s to the new reboot. So I like that. And something that I really thought was off is when Mamoru took Chibiusa home, Usagi was kind of distant from him. Because he was telling her, you know, give her time. I don't think she's that bad. And she's kind of distant. And when Mamoru tries to kiss her, she pushes away. And that kind of threw me off. Because I'm thinking, he's your true love. You love him. Why are you doing this? Because in the 90s, at this point, they broke. he broke up with her. So that didn't happen. At least I don't believe that happened. Um, here yet, anyway. So I don't know why she was distant. If someone can please... Uh, clear me up on that. That would be great. Overall, I really liked the episode from what I can remember because I, I watched it really early this, in the morning. Uh, so, yeah. The next episode will be March. The first Saturday in March. I'll have to check the date on that. But uh, wait, maybe it's the... I believe it's March 7th is the... Uh, next episode but again i will check and get back to you on that uh but yeah that's all i can remember for from this episode of crystal and uh yeah i i hope everyone is giving crystal a chance i really like it um but yeah so yeah overall this episode was really good so yeah the next one who takes over in the next episode i believe will be avery I'll have to know how to say her Japanese name later, but I believe that's the next Ayakashi sister that we'll see. And I believe she's going to fight either Jupiter or Venus. I don't know. Um, but that's my guess. I believe Jupiter's... Yeah, Jupiter's next. But I don't know what Ayakashi sister she fights yet. So, yeah. So there you go. That is my review for Act 16 of Sailor Moon Crystal Abduction Sailor Mercury. I'll be back later with another Sailor Moon Crystal review. Bye.